know, sociologists have figured out that one of our biggest problems in modern day life is how to fill our leisure time. And figuring out stuff like that is how the sociologists fill their leisure time. <laughs> Uh, between the population explosion and all this new leisure time, they're gonna have to build a lot of new corners to hang around on. <laughs> Boris says vacations are just a capitalistic trick, because in order to get one, you gotta take a job. <laughs> My crowd at college has a problem filling our mid-semester break. We can't decide whether to reinvade Chicago, run down to Fort Lauderdale for the annual riots, or just stay on the campus and send out for Eldridge Cleaver. You know, I spend all my leisure time uh, enjoying my hobby. What's your hobby? What's your name? <laughs> my doctor's opposed to the fort. We, uh... <laughs> having an extra day. Okay. In um, Russia, flags are being burnt and students and intellectuals are rioting in the streets. It's nice to see our two great countries coming closer together. My boss let me off early last week. They were having a Christmas party and he told me to go home. <laughs> All those new labor-saving devices at work give us more time off, and we can use it to repair all those new labor-saving devices at home. Whenever I have a free moment, I like to call Dial a Prayer and argue theology with the rector. Peter, what do you suppose Hugh Hefner does on his spare time? In what spare time? <laughs> Say, with the increased leisure time, married couples now have a chance to really get to know each other, which may explain the increased divorce rate. Leisure time's a problem in my neighborhood, too, but there we call it unemployment. <laughs> <laughs> 